Hi everyone and welcome back to The Hair Loss Show. My name is Dr. Vikram J. Aprikash, and in today's episode we're going to talk about caffeine and how it can be used to treat hair loss. So stick around. Welcome to The Hair Loss Show. To Russell Knudsen and Dr. Vikram J. Aprikash discuss issues relating to hair loss and the medical and surgical treatment of hair loss in both men and women. Hi everyone, and so let's talk about caffeine for hair loss. Now caffeine can be used, uh, and I've seen a lot of people uh, post questions, well how is caffeine used and how does it treat hair loss? It can be used in a couple of different ways. First of all, caffeine can be an additive for other medications. So you can, when you get a medication specifically compounded, like finasteride or minoxidil, you can, uh, the compounding pharmacy will sometimes add caffeine. And the benefit of that is that it uh, promotes penetration of the medication into the, uh, through the scalp into the, uh, into the capillary bed. Now, the reason that happens, one, it uh, opens up uh, these uh, channels uh, and allows medication to pass through the barrier a lot more effectively. Also, we know that caffeine acts as a vasodilator, so it improves blood flow to the area. And we think also, going back, that's probably another mechanism by which it uh, stimulates hair growth by increasing blood flow to, to the area kind of sim in a similar sort of way that uh, minoxidil works as well so caffeine will also have a stimulatory effect uh, on the on the hair follicle as well now another way that uh, caffeine also uh, is reported to work is that it potentially uh, blocks uh, DHT and so we know that certainly in men with male pattern hair loss being a genetic condition it also uh, the increase in uh, the levels of DHT dihydrotestosterone also causes miniaturization of the hair so by blocking the actually blocking the DHT which works differently to finasteride which doesn't block DHT it, it blocks the enzyme and therefore lowers the level of DHT caffeine directly uh, blocks DHT and so um, we'll hope uh, the theory being that it can help prevent hair loss that way. Now it's not a very um, well studied um, compound, obviously it's naturally existing, we drink coffee uh, every day and, and, and drinking coffee orally, there's no evidence to suggest that that has any uh, positive, benefit, positive or negative benefit on the hair follicle. But direct application, topical application of caffeine has been uh, shown to be helpful and I think there's very little downside so uh, I'd be happy with that. So hope you found that sort of brief summary useful on caffeine for hair loss. Uh, thanks again for watching. Please remember to like and subscribe to the channel and we'll see you again on the next episode. Take care.